Shovel and welcome to my channel. Today I am doing another drawing video, but today I asked you guys to send me your favorite Disney characters. I'm going to try and draw them from memory. I'm old, so I haven't seen any of these old classic Disney characters in a while, but you guys are sending me a lot of different ones, which I'm pretty impressed with. So the first suggestion of Disney character I'm going to take is Stitch. And I think that that one should be pretty easy. I should never say that about anyone. All right, his ears are like really big. He's got like little hairs on his head. <laughs> I hope. That ear is way bigger than the other ear. How'd that happen? Okay. Proportions are very important in this. Clearly. All right, so this is his head. He's got little pink bits in his ear and his nose is definitely not pink. Now he looks like a rabbit. His nose is black. Those are his eyes, in case you were wondering. I was wondering too. This is really great so far. He's got like a little lumpy body. His toes have like, I have no idea how his toes look. Does he have a tail? He's got like a little nub tail, right? And if he's an alien, he got, he's got he got to have his little antennas. That's Stitch. If you didn't know. This is what he looks like. <laughs> Okay, next suggestion I'm gonna take is Mushu, which is the dragon from Mulan. So he, I feel like, shouldn't be too bad. Does he got little teeth? I feel like he's got teeth. I have no idea. And like little nose slits, because he's a dragon. He's got like cute little flop ears. Now he looks like a mouse. Um, Mushu, I'm so sorry. I can't think of what these things look like. Does he have like those little dragon mustachey bits that come out? I have no idea. He's got like a little slithery, slithery, slithery snake. It's been a while since I've seen Mulan. Let's be honest. That's not too far off. Like not terribly, terribly. Should I be looking up a picture to confirm? Oh, I think that's actually pretty good. The next suggestion is Sora, which is from a game called Kingdom Hearts that I'm a huge fan of. I'm gonna butcher his face. Uh, I need like a, a skin tone kinda. That's good enough. So he needs to look super anime. So we're gonna do his face. And he's gotta have the really big spiky anime hair. That looks like an anime face. I don't know. I have no idea. I can't remember what he looks like. Um. He wears like a little black t-shirt. Oh, he needs a neck. No, you know what? That's fine. Um, he wears like a little black shirt and big baggy red pants. Like Harlem pants. That looks something else. And big yellow shoes. And he's got like his little chain bit here. And he needs his arms so that he can hold his keyblade. That's actually not that bad. That's, that's, I mean, it's, it's. It's Sora. Next suggestion is Nemo. I think that that should be pretty simple and straightforward considering he's a fish. So this is his head. And then his little body is just gonna be like here. He's got his stripes. We're gonna use a paint bucket on here. He's gotta have his one fin and his little fin. He's gotta have his massive animation eyes. He looks a little insane right now. Does he even know? Fish don't have noses. Do you have anything on his head? Did he have like a little bit here? I feel like I just made him look insane. I think he might be, and that's why he got lost. Next suggestion is the Cheshire Cat. Um, I really can't think of what that guy looks like. I know he's got a nice big head with a massive smile. If anything, I'll get that right. And it's gonna have nice big stripes and a nice tail with more stripes and little nubby feet. There's the Cheshire Cat! I think that looks probably the most accurate of any of them just because the face is pretty dead on. Next edition I'm gonna take is Baymax from Big Hero 6. I love this movie and I have to actually do Baymax justice for this one. So he's got his, his little round eyes like that. This is gonna look the most accurate of any of them because I know exactly what he looks like. I lied, I did really poorly. Did he have a heart? He does now. This is Baymax. <laughs> I 
think Shadow wants to be a Disney character. Next tradition is Beauty and the Beast. So I'm going to draw a little bell right here with little hair. That's a top bun if you were wondering. This is bad. This is already really bad. Uh, here's the top of her dress and the bottom of her dress. And little shoes. Now we're going to draw the Beast. All right, now I'm gonna draw Merida. I like the movie Brave. I know she has like a greenish dress, like a, a weird bluish something. I have no idea. Um, I'm gonna go like that. Her little feet. I have no idea how to do these. Um, little arms. Most importantly is her hair. First, I got. Let me just give her a face. Okay. Now, most importantly is her hair, and that's Merida. This is probably actually the most accurate. <laughs> Somebody suggested Darth Vader, which technically Star Wars characters are Disney characters. So I'm gonna do Darth Vader. He's got like big spooky eyes and a big grill mouth as far as I know. Yeah, he's got a grill. Um, this looks more like the helmet guy from Spaceballs. He's gotta have a nice big cape because that's the important part. I feel like he's got like different colored buttons on his chest or something to breathe and live and stuff. So let's just put some buttons there. I don't know why I'd make him muscly. He doesn't have arms or legs. Uh, at least not real ones. Darth Vader, everybody! Next suggestion I'm going to take is Moana. I actually haven't seen this movie yet. But I've seen the picture, so I know what she looks like. Um, but I'm really afraid of ruining it. But she's got a head. So far, I'm nailing it. She's got... Big, wavy black hair. So, oh, so still nailing it. Let's just have, like, the ocean in the background. I'm doing, like, scenery now before I even finish her body. Uh, the water's gonna have a little face right there. <laughs> um, she's got, like, an orangey top or something. Oh, man, I really need to see this movie. She's got, like, a little tube top going on. That's Moana. I think that's the best I could do without having actually seen the movie and having no idea what anything looks like. Last Disney character I'm gonna draw is a Disney princess. I'm gonna let you guess who it is. Can you guess who it is? I'm just kidding. That's the end of today's video. Leave a like if you enjoyed watching. Tell me down in the comments what kind of characters I should draw from memory next time and who I should draw with. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.